Yep. Here you go. All right, Ranger here, ReadyUpGaming.com. I'm here with John from Denial. How you doing, man? Yeah, I'm doing pretty good. Uh, we just got off on a tough loss against NB, uh, we're gonna try to bounce back. Uh, Anything in particular that happened in the in the game that you guys can correct? Um. No, we just choked. We just kept choking. You know, we lost by one on blitz, lost by like five points on like all together on domination. Lost by one round on S and D. You know, it's just our fault. But we'll check it out next time. So, uh, with tracker sites and gillies and all that stuff with this event, do you guys feel like you, especially with Fizz on the team, do you guys feel like that gives you guys a big advantage with the tracker um, sites and stuff? To be honest, I'm the only one that uses the tracker site. I use it like I bring it out in like some situations. I think, uh, yeah, I'm the only one that uses the tracker site. You know, duck complex is the only one that uses the suit. And you know, we really don't use, uh, we use double nades as well. Double nades, yeah. yeah but, I've heard from that from a couple of teams. Yeah, only two people use it on our team. So it's like people think that we use all the cheap shit, but like it's not like we all use it. You know, it's like. So it's not as bad as everybody makes it out yeah, to be. We have our own, we play in our own situation, like we make our own plays. Uh, I don't want to say it on camera, but, you know, I don't want people to catch on to it, but um, yeah. So this is our second event now for Ghost. How do you feel the metagame has changed since Columbus so far? Um, it's a lot more fast based. People are not scared to push. Uh, domination is more rotation, you know, more fast based domination. People are not like setting up with ARs as much. People are like pushing a lot more with subs, using Incon, using Thermal, using Tracker, Smoke, Double Nate. So it's, you know, it's changed a lot. A lot of people didn't know about that Columbus. Um, so, you know, metagames changed a lot. People just gotta catch on. Do you, uh, you have any advice for any of the AMs out there watching that are looking to uh, improve their game moving forward? Such as like joining the team or just trying to get better. Just, at the just, game. just get better at the game in general as a um, team for Ghost. I feel like I just like once I just get into a team house. I'm not saying you guys have to move into a team house, but like once I move into a team house, we start playing a lot of GB tournaments, start playing a lot of GBs together. You know, just play with the team a lot, and try to improve with the team. What's your opinion on eights? Do you feel like? Playing eights mixed in with playing with your team, do you feel like that gives you an edge as an individual? Um, like knowledge wise of the game? Is as important. Uh, I really don't think you get better at eights. It's just people just run around, people use ARs. You know, I just mess around with eights all the time. Um, you can take it serious, but I honestly don't think it improves your, you know, your gameplay at all. Mm -hmm. You play these tournaments, you know, people are putting money in and they want to, they're trying as hard as they can because they don't want to lose that money. So, you know, it's just gambling pretty much. So. Yeah, there's, there's nothing invested in it when you're playing eights. No big deal. Gotcha. Alrighty, um, you got any shout outs for us? Um, shout out to Denial, Denial Gaming, shout out to all the sponsors. We have awesome. a lot. Um, so, <laughs> shout out to all the sponsors. And yeah. Uh, hey man, I appreciate the interview as always. We look forward to seeing you guys uh, do really good things this event. Thanks, man. Appreciate it, buddy.